Oh my. What's up, boys? We have completed the 88 rated Jacob Ramsey Foot Academy objective. It took not as long as the other objectives, not as long as the Gordon or the Lindstrom, but he looks really good. 85 pace, 88 dribbling, and 85 physical. Hullet Gang, English Premier League midfielder for free. Got flair and flair passer traits. That is really good. Great balance on him, 94. Decent decent defensive stats, really good standing tackle, 90 stamina. Like the pace split with the acceleration and the sprint speed. This version has four star weak foot and three star skills. Pretty good for a box to box and can play a bunch of secondary positions, CDM, right mid, and cam. I'm gonna put a shadow on him just to get that defensive awareness up. It, it needs a bit of a boost. Yeah, 76 all the way up to 80. First game. Go Ramsey, let's test this, this left stick. Okay. His dribbling is gonna be so beneficial when building out from the back. Drop in, yes, Ramsey. He feels really fast. Compared to his 86, he feels rapid. Good tackle, Ramsey. I didn't even press anything there. Considering that there aren't too many really good future stars in the promo teams, this Ramsey is even more desirable because he has as good stats, if not better, than the majority of cards you to get on the market. Send him. Good ball, Ramsey. Good ball, Ramsey. Bruh. What am I doing? I'm a lemon. I'm a Ramsey, no! Come on, Ramsey, bomb it up from the midfield. Green time finesse in the box. What he's gonna do? If, if you play a three center mid formation, keep him on the outside, probably the right right footed bomb up the field, center mid, box to box. Even if you play him stay back, and you just you can send him forward with manual runs, and he can do really well. Good step, Ramsey. Good strength. Come on, one goal, one assist for the main man, and we get a rage quit in game number one. Just a couple things I noticed from game one. Looking at the pace, he felt much faster in game. I don't know if that's a shadow or just some cards feel faster than their base stat. And defensively, he was fine. Positioning was really good. Interceptions were good. But the biggest thing that stands out is the dribbling. He is turning on a dime with that R1 dribbling. 5.11 is definitely going to help it out. And the, I didn't mention this earlier, but high, high work rates with a player with these end games is, is the best kind of work rates. Game number two. Like this. <laughs> what was that strength? He just sat, sat that man down. Oh no. Someone like De Bruyne makes that shot, but you don't get De Bruyne for free for playing online friendly. Go Ramsey. Look at that. Acceleration is there. I wish he had four I wish he was four star four star because I really want to hit some skill moves right now. That that three star skills in the box limits him a, a little bit. You look at that, make him miss. This is what he offers you in the midfield. You get a guy that's playing press, keep the ball, pass the ball. Sorry, what? <laughs> no way, man. <laughs> Jacob Ramsey getting it done with the DA! Okay, disconnect. After that game, I've come to the conclusion that the chem style shadow is probably the best version for him as the defensive awareness really needs that upgrade, uh, interceptions, and can't really hurt, and heading accuracy. I, I guess it's just good, but the, the biggest benefit is the sliding tackle and the standing tackle. Pace feels really good, and he's not that hard of an objective to complete compared to this Lindstrom. This Lindstrom, I did him when he came out. It took me over 24 hours. So I'm recording this. It still hasn't been 24 hours since this has been released and I didn't really grind it. I was sort of playing the matches, putting the controller down. I was able to start a match, put my controller down and leave, watch a movie, do some work. It was, it was a very enjoyable experience compared to this Lindstrom. Also having it be online was really nice. You only had to win four games. There was only four requirements out of like the 25 games that needed a win. So that was really nice. Made it go by fast. Lindstrom was very awful. And then this Gordon. This Gordon is, I would say, rivaling Ramsey for the best Academy Future Stars objective. But again, this Gordon takes six foot champs qualifier game wins and then playing 12 foot champs finals matches. So, and this isn't even the version. I haven't even gotten the version yet because I haven't played my 12 foot champs finals. It's the 88 version of Gordon. And this Ramsey was just the most enjoyable, the fastest, and arguably the best card out of the three some are going to say gordon's better maybe he is four star five star the 86 will be but this is a really solid box to box coming off the bench if you have a really good team for me on the rtg this is a new starting center mid 
secondary positions as well adds that extra value and the english Premier League links he is a great player i think he scored a pretty big goal against man united last year two years ago so this guy's been around but he's still really young born in 2001 so he's got a bright bright career ahead of him and a very good fifa card to go along with it 88 bullet gang we mentioned that earlier and just one other thing i'd like to point out this 93 short passing is insane the shot power being 86 not great 83 finishing is not great but He'll be able to finish when you put him in a good position or when you get him in those opportunities where a box to box is sort of getting in front of goal because your box to box doesn't get in front of goal say as much as your striker but still has that need or that ability to put the ball in the back of the net and he can do that i, I like the traits adds a little bit of that that flair that pizzazz and the r1 dribbling was top tier for a center mid strength wise 85 strength is going to help him out with that size it's really a just a perfect well-rounded free objective box to box mid but if you guys enjoyed the video leave a like subscribe and i'll see you guys next time peace